Kate scolds Prince William over Prince Louis comment don't forget Charlotte. Kate scolded her husband Prince William for forgetting Princess Charlotte when he spoke about their children's love of DIY as they stepped for out a series of royal engagements in London today. The Duke and Duchess of Cambridge completed a number of engagements in the capital this afternoon. During a visit to the London Bridge Job Centre, Kate and William chatted to employers helping people find jobs during the coronavirus crisis. They spoke to community engagement manager for Kelt Bray, Lloyd Graham, who told them how the construction company is involved in the demolition of some local buildings for the redevelopment of the Elephant and Castle area. William said, the children, especially Louis would love to come and watch that, to see the diggers, they love it. But Kate added, don't forget Charlotte, she'd love it too. HR business partner at Leyland, Sandra McNamara, told the couple the DIY firm has been recruiting and that the industry has performed well during the lockdown. William joked, in terms of DIY, men think they can do everything when it comes to DIY. I think that's why everything falls apart. Do you think in the UK, in terms of skill sets, do we sell ourselves well enough in Britain? Ms McNamara replied, I think we need to be better at it. The Cambridge has also met customers who are now jobless following the coronavirus outbreak and others who have recently found employment. A fifth Ben Khaled, who lost her job in a commercial bank in May when her contract wasn't renewed, said after the visit, For me, it's so important that the Duke and Duchess come and hear about what is going and hear what is happening in their country. People are going through difficulties. It was important to be frank and tell them life is not great for everyone. We're not all living in castles. Some people are really struggling, with their mental health too. William and Kate's next engagement was to the East London Mosque and London Muslim Centre in Shadwell. They chatted to volunteers who delivered food and medication to vulnerable members of the community during the pandemic. The couple also spoke to those who benefited from the support, a project which has received financial help from the National Emergencies Trust of which William is patron. The mosque's senior Imam Muhammad Mahoud brought up the issue of mental health with the royals. He said later, I highlighted the issue of people increasingly needing support with their mental health, the Muslim community as well as the rest of the UK, who have been horrifically affected by the pandemic in terms of losing jobs and livelihoods. The Cambridges finished their day of engagements at Bagel Bake in Brick Lane. They had a go at bagel making at the 24-hour bakery which was forced to reduce its opening hours during the coronavirus outbreak. The couple heard how this affected employees, and how the eatery helped the local community through food donations and deliveries. Fiona McVie, who has worked at the bakery for 33 years, said, They are pretty good, especially her, she clearly knows how to bake. Kate, 38, looked typically stunning in a red dress teamed with a pair of tan heels for the day of engagements. She wore a floral face mask and had her glossy brunette hair in loose curls. William, 38, was smart in a blazer, white shirt, chinos, brown suede shoes and blue face covering. The Cambridges spent much of the coronavirus lockdown at Anmer Hall in Norfolk. They kept busy carrying out virtual engagements. The parents of three also had their hands full homeschooling Prince George, 7, Charlotte, 5, and Prince Louis, 2. They have resumed face-to-face -face royal duties as restrictions have eased.